Welcome to Clavicinica, a powerful program designed to help you improve your character knowledge and reading skills in modern Chinese. This demo will provide a brief introduction to the main features of the software. When we first launch the program, we see a blank screen called the Text Reader Window. We can copy and paste content from any Chinese text document or website into this window. For now, however, we'll simply open one of the sample text files provided with the program. In this window, I can click on any character I don't recognize in order to bring up the pronunciation and meaning of the character, as well as the pronunciation and meaning of the compound word in which it is used. I can also get a sense of the relative importance of the character by checking its usage frequency, as well as the number of compounds which it forms. If I'm uncertain about the sound of the character, I can have it pronounced for me in the voice of a native speaker. I. This one-click lookup feature makes reading any unfamiliar Chinese text a much more efficient and enjoyable process. But if we really want to improve our reading skills, simply getting through the text is not enough. We can build our vocabulary much more quickly if we understand why the new characters we're learning are written the way they are and how they may be connected to other words we already know. For any character in the text, we can bring up a new character information window that provides a wealth of additional information about the character, its structure, and its relationship to other characters and words. In this window, we can view the character's simplified and traditional forms, its variant pronunciations and meanings, a brief etymological note, and, most importantly, its radical and phonetic parts. If we want to find out more about the radical component, we can bring up a new window that shows us what the radical represents and provides a list of other characters using the same radical so that we can begin to understand how the radical contributes to the meaning of the characters that it forms. When learning a new character, it can also be useful to see how it's used in a variety of compound words, enabling us to recognize, for example, that the shuo character in bie shuo is the same as the shuo character in gan shuo. Some characters also have an additional phonetic root, which can be useful to look at on its own, as it can provide clues to the pronunciation of the character. In this case, for example, the phonetic part indicates a sound which is very similar across a variety of characters. Even if I don't recognize some of these characters now, I can quickly see that learning the sound value of this component will be useful to me in the future. As I read through the text, clicking on characters that I don't recognize, all of these characters are automatically added to my personal character inventory. The character inventory keeps track of all of the characters that I'm learning, as well as how well I've learned them, and then arranges customized review sessions for me accordingly. When I begin a review session, I am tested on the pronunciation and meaning of characters selected from my personal character inventory. The program keeps track of my answers and tests me more frequently on the characters that have given me the most trouble over time. If I get a character wrong, I'm given the opportunity to learn more about its structure and its connections with other words by bringing up its character information window. I can track my progress over time in mastering the characters I've been working on using the character inventory statistics window. This window also tracks my recent and highest scores on a built-in assessment test that estimates the total number of characters I already know, providing a helpful way to measure my progress learning the language over time. If I want to focus on studying the vocabulary in the text that I'm working on, I can automatically create a flashcard set populated by some or all of the characters and compounds in that text. The software includes a powerful bilingual dictionary as well, allowing me to look up words by character, compound, radical, or English meaning. Characters can be searched by pinyin, stroke order, or radical number. The desired character can then be selected from a list to bring up the corresponding character information window. Compound searches bring up a list of all words with a matching pinyin value, enabling the student to distinguish among the sounds of words that differ only in their tones. The English search function is unusually versatile. Search results include all words and characters 
for which the search term appears anywhere in their definitions. Every character shown in this and other program windows is clickable, allowing me to review the structure of familiar characters and explore the connections among interrelated words, leveraging the power of associative memory to learn new words through their connections with words I already know. Clavicinica means key to the Chinese language. It is by unlocking the structure of the written language in these ways that the Clavicinica software can open the door for you to a more rewarding and productive study of Chinese.